All right there, my friends. For this lesson, we are practicing four-digit times two-digit numbers. This first win video is going to be about the window method. Remember, this is a should do, so it's not required, but I love how you're challenging yourself. So the problem we will practice with is 2,535 times 47. Now, a lot of it is exactly the same. The main difference is just that I'm making a bigger box so that I have room for two digits that way and four digits that way, right? Because I have one, two, three, four, so I need four boxes. Two digits, so I need two going down. So I'm going to write the value of each spot. So that first two is 2,000. Then I have 535. And I have 47. All right. Now, as you know, we multiply this times this. Put it in this box. So 2 times 4 is 8. Now, just so I have 1, 2, 3, 4. So I'll put 1, 2, 3, 4 zeros there. So I have 80,000. More zeros to keep track of, the bigger the number gets. 5 times 4 is 20. Notice I have 1, 2, 3 zeros. So I put 1, 2, 3 additional zeros. That 0 of the 20 um, is just part of that basic fact. I need 3 more zeros after that. Then I have 30 times 40. So 3 times 4 is 12 with two zeros. And then uh, last but not least, I have 5 times 40. So 5 times 4 is 20. And then put another 0 on for that extra 0. I go ahead and use my same colors. So for the thousands, 2,000 times 7. 2 times 7 is 14. Three zeros put on. 500 times 7, I get 5 times 7 is 35 with two zeros. 30 times 7, 3 times 7 is 21, put a zero on. And then 5 times 7 is 35, and there are no zeros on that one. So now I have a lot of numbers to add up. I have eight numbers, so I have to be careful that I'm not writing them incorrectly or lining them up incorrectly. can help to put the commas, so then you know um, to line up your commas as well as on the right side. 1,200, 200. Now I could add up line by line and then add those two numbers together. I'm going to go ahead and add all the numbers at once, but there are lots of strategies for how to add the numbers up if it feels like a lot. Oh, and of course I ran out of space. Sorry about that. I'll squeeze it in the bottom. Now, if I had a notebook, I would just make sure I did it where I had plenty of space. I'm a little constrained by this um, whiteboard app I'm using. So when I get 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1 plus 3 is 4. 0, 0, 2 plus 2 is 4. Plus 5 is 9. 10, 11. Write that, carry the 1. 1, 2, plus 4 is 6, 7, 8, 9. And then 8 plus 2 is um, 10, plus 1 is 11. So I get 119,145 for that problem. I will do one more. If you got it, you can go ahead and try it. But if you want to watch another example, that's what I'm here for. So this next one is 3,438 times 81. So again, bigger box because I have more numbers. Four digit by two digit. 3,438 times 81. One. My thousands, 3,000 times 80. Well, 3 times 8 is 24. 1, 2, 3, 4 zeros. 3, 4. And then I put my commas. It's always good to wait until after I write all the zeros so I know where the comma goes. 
Now I have 400 times 80. Well, 4 times 8 is 32. 1, 2, 3 zeros. 30 times 80. 3 times 8 is 24. Put on two zeros. And 8 times 80. 8 times 8 is 64. With one zero put on there. Now I will do my next row. This one is easy because it's just times one. So 3,000 times one is 3,000. Anything times one is itself. You don't need to add any zeros because one doesn't have any zeros on it. So that row is a little simpler. Now, I don't want to run out of space, so I'm going to write a little smaller than I did last time. All right, I have 240,000, 32,000, 2,400, 640. So if I know I'm going to have a lot of numbers, I either want to write small or just make sure I have enough space. Because I've seen kids try to squeeze it in, and that's often when they make mistakes. Because they can't read what they wrote. So 0008, 004 plus 3 is 7, 4 plus 6 is 10, plus 4 is 14, 1 plus 2 is 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 4 plus 3 is 7, and just my 2 there. Count 1, 2, 3, and put my comma. So I get 278,000. 478. If you want more examples, just let me know. You can do it. Good luck. Remember, you don't have to show all your work on the paper. Do it on a notebook. Just write your answer on the paper. That is fine.